Hey everyone, I'm Grand Hall, and welcome to the Week 7 review of Molly Jam Do. First up, we had Baby Don't Hurse Me, which really felt like it wanted to be controlled with a touchscreen rather than with a mouse. If you run over, I think it's three people, then a trailer gets affixed to the hearse, and you have less room to work with. Sure, the roof of the hearse is larger, so in theory it's easier to get people to land on it, but there's less room to see the people and start flicking them upwards. Then three more people, and there's a second trailer, and you've lost at that point. There's, there's no coming back from it. Next up was Hello World, where despite all the messages being written by people on the internet, we managed to avoid any vulgarity. Crazy. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> Someone decided to make this into a story. After that was Sacrificer, which let us play game designer on the worst PC we could possibly be designing a game on. Wait, is the hat all that's left? Oh, don't make me get rid of my hat! It is so dashing! Fine. I win! Yay! I'm gonna fly my magic carpet out to sea. Then was Groin Gravitators, which was a game you should only play with someone you're very comfortable with. So I'm not sure there's all that much more to show on this one. Really? Uh, aside from this is what happens with us, like, all the time, actually. But, uh... Next was the most interesting trigger in the world, which rewarded players with memes. I think I see it. Did I just see it? I believe I just saw it. Hmm. Was that it? Or was there more? Then we had Conspicuous, where my job was to eavesdrop on people and figure out who was a terrorist. I think they're talking about Evo. Or not Evo, um, Eve, that's the one. So I don't think they're the ones. And they're talking about a flamethrower? And finally, we had Scent of Death, which may not have been finished, but it still had some sweet backflip physics. Which means all you can really do is go back and forward and occasionally pick up the coffin and occasionally drop it. And occasionally make it do crazy flips like I've been doing. Like that! And that was week 7 of Molly Jam Do. You guys can look forward to more appearances by Peter in the coming weeks. Until then, and even after then, I'm Granhall. See you guys next time.